Hi, I'm Lauren with Red Pocket Mobile. We're really excited that you're signing up with our service. Today I'm here to show you how to activate your device in just a quick few and easy steps. In order to activate your phone, please be sure that you've received the email that was sent through your eBay messages containing your activation pin. If you have a non-LTE CDMA device, you will not need to use the SIM card that was mailed to you, so please keep it in a safe place for future purposes. If you do have an LTE compatible CDMA device, you will need to use the SIM card that was mailed to you. For this service, you will need the Triple Punch LTE SIM card. You'll simply need to go through the activation and configuration processes to get your phone to work. The starter kit will also include an instructional flyer and a total of three SIM cards. Okay, let's go online to MyEasyActivation.com. I have pulled up a browser window using Google Chrome. If you prefer Internet Explorer, Firefox, or Safari, any of those browsers will work as well. Starting from the top, click Activate Your Device to get started with activating your phone. Now we'll select the network type for your phone you have. As this is a CDMA device, I'm going to click the CDMA Device button. If you need more information on what type of device you have, please read over the information in this help box for more details. Next, you'll enter in the ESNMEID number. This can generally be located on the back of your device underneath the battery. If this is an Android, you can also dial star pound zero six pound and the information will display on your screen. Alternatively, for an iPhone, enter the settings, general, about, and view the IMEI. If this is a 4G LTE device and the SIM ID, aka the ICC ID, will need to be entered as well. The SIM ID number is the number located on the bottom of the SIM card labeled ICC ID. This starts with 8914. Enter the 14-digit activation code that was sent to you in the thank you email you received right after you completed your purchase. For this next step, we have a couple of options. If you're getting a new phone number and service plan with us and do not plan on bringing your number over from the previous plan, simply click the No button. If you do plan on bringing your number over, you'll need to fill out the information from your current carrier, including your current account information. Please note that even if you are with a prepaid cell phone company, there is always an account number required for porting or moving your number over. If you don't have this account information, please contact your previous provider. Entering inaccurate information can lead to issues with your port and may tag your number until the issue is resolved. Now you fill out your personal information below. If for any reason we need to contact you about your account, we will need to verify your information, so please be sure the information is correct when filling everything out. Finally, please be sure to read over the terms and conditions and privacy policy. After agreeing to this information, please select the submit button to complete the activation. If you choose to get a new number, it will be displayed after submitting your request. If you choose to port an existing number in, please note that this can take on average between 5 minutes to 24 hours to process. This is dependent on whether you put in the correct information and how fast your current provider releases the phone number. After you clicked on the submit button and received a phone number, if you have an LTE compatible device, please put the SIM card into the phone. Shown here are three different SIM types and then power on the phone. The phone should program automatically. If you do not have an LTE compatible phone and do not need to insert a SIM card into the phone, you will need to turn on the phone and press either star 22890 or star 228. Press send and listen to the voice commands as the device programs automatically. Important note, if you have an LTE compatible device, do not use star 22890 or star 228. When sending us an email, please be sure to be as descriptive with the issues you're experiencing as possible. We would appreciate if you can supply the type of device and the SIM card number that you're trying to install and your name and phone number to contact you. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoy your service with us.